Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm gonna show you how you can create morph targets from metahumans uh, and by that I mean from metahuman faces and bodies. So we have this uh, metahuman which uh, is using a uh, normal weight uh, body. So let's uh, load the body as well. This is a normal weight body but we want a morph target that make, makes it underweight and overweight as well, right? We will also bring the faces uh, of uh, uh, the other body types. So we have this uh, face. Let's search for the face here. So we have Rowan. This is one face. And we also have, uh, let me, Yuri, right? So we we'll also bring the faces as morph targets as well. Uh, they have the same height and uh, just the, the weight of uh, the body is different, right? So uh, let's uh, also check the body. So uh, this is uh, Yuri's body, uh, which is uh, overweight. And let's open the other one. And uh, this is underweight uh, body, which is for Rowan, right? So we want to bring this uh, into our uh, normal weight uh, metahuman as morph targets. So uh, let's get started. Let's uh, close this. We don't need them right now. And first we will proceed uh, with the face. Uh, with Match Morpher, we can quickly uh, create uh, those uh, morph targets from different metahumans. We just go to Create from Mesh and we just search for our faces. And uh, we will call this Rowan. Right? Uh, we're going to match by UV and no smoothing right well the rest is uh default let's press ok let's uh, close this file uh this dialog here and uh, let's uh, load uh, the other one which was yuri this is the overweight meta human and we just pick the new name it's gonna be yuri let's press ok and we can close this dialog here and uh, let's check them out we first load yuri this looks good and let's check Rowan we will see that Rowan has a spike here this couldn't be matched by UVs and uh, to fix these cases where we have certain spikes you just double click the morph target go to Laplacian smooth which is this triangle here and click on uh, apply uh, fix spikes right and uh, now uh, that spike is gone right and uh, now you can save it if you close it will ask you to save let's uh, save this okay now we can test it and we will see that uh, it doesn't have any spike we can load the uh, both morph targets and check them out uh, let's save this and we will move to the body let's open the body uh, which is at normal weight and we will do the same for the bodies we will go to create from mesh files and we will search for Rowan and we will select the body we will give the same name just so we can keep track of what we're doing here and then uh, we will search for Yuri we will uh, pick the body mesh let's give the name here and uh, let's press OK. Uh, now we can test them uh, as well to see if we have everything uh, correctly created and it looks like we have. And uh, to see how well they blend uh, uh, together, we can uh, uh, go to Tools, select Reference Mesh and we will search for the normal weight uh, face. And first, let's test the Yuri Morph Target. And we will trigger Yuri as well here. This is the Yuri Morph target. Okay. And then uh, let's check for uh, Rowan. And uh, this is also uh, uh, blending uh, nicely. If you have this scene here, just go to uh, Persona, 
uh, search uh, for the body material, recompute tangents, just set it to green, save, and that's it, right? Easy fix. So uh, this is how you uh, bring metahuman as morph targets, so you can blend nicely between them. And uh, yeah, uh, I hope you like this video, guys. Uh, this is uh, an easy way to create uh, uh, diversification for your characters, so you can easily morph from one character to another without having multiple metahumans. You can now delete Rowan and Yuri metahumans as you already have uh the shapes as morph targets right uh i hope you uh enjoy this video uh don't forget to hit the like button if you did uh hit the dislike button if you didn't and see you around bye